Yo, what is cracking? Because it is your boy Cyber. Today we are here with week six of the major Pokemon League versus Jolt of the Token Minorities and the Toronto Star Raptors. Now we did play Jolt in the NPL, but we are here facing him today in week six. Um, Poi used to be actually the head coach of the Miami Heat Morphs, who uh, dropped out of season two, or obviously of season three of week two. Um, well, after week two, I should say. And we actually asked Jolt to take over for the Miami Heat Moors. And obviously he said, yeah, he'll do it. Uh, I made a couple transactions. I did have a team builder for it. But unfortunately, uh, I just like our me and Jolt's time zones didn't really just meet up uh, or at least, you know, like work schedules. Uh, so we just kind of had to like knock it out ASAP as soon as we could. And obviously, and unfortunately, this will be going up very late Saturday, Sunday, maybe early Monday. Um, but today, again, like I said, I'm playing Jolt. So make sure you guys go show Jolt some love in the description below, as well as me with my Twitch, Twitter and Instagram links. All those are down below. Um, your Detroit right or live hearts are actually going four and one right now. This is going to be a big win if we take it. It might not seem like it, but it's going to be a big win. Just because if we get this win, obviously, uh, it'll put us in first place, I believe, if we pass Jordy or not. I'm not sure. But again, if you guys are hyped for today's battle, make sure you guys hit that thumbs up down below. It's going to be greatly appreciated. Um, I have Jolt's team all, you know, prepperized and stuff. Um, I'll maybe actually upload the team builder before I upload this, and then, you know, we'll go from there. But uh, I have my camera ready because I got to take a picture of this team. So without further ado, make sure you guys subscribe for more, and let's go ahead and get into this. I have Kelks up. I have everything ready. Let's get into this. I'm so nervous to play Jolt because I lost 3-0 to Jolt last time, so it was kind of unfortunate. Um, but he is bringing a squad. He, everything I predicted for except for... Silv oh wait no yeah he brought Sylvia never mind um I predicted everything the only thing I didn't see him not bringing let's see Sizzle? yeah he brought the top five so he didn't okay so he didn't bring the um he did not bring the uh what's it called what's it called what's it called the Sableye which is huge um okay so we definitely need a lead we definitely need a lead but who's our lead I could definitely see him leading um either Scizor or Thunder's T so with that being said, with that being said, who do we lead with? Who do we lead with? I have my viewer open right here. That way I don't have to keep looking down at my screen. So who do we lead? Who do we lead? Who do we lead? Um, I kind of want to lead Gliscor, even though he could, pre he could predict that and actually lead with Swampert. Um, I'm actually just going to lead with Kyurem, honestly, just because I can get a stab big something off, to be honest. Um, and then if he leads a Salamence, we're going to be kind of in trouble. But again, Joel, good luck to you. Make sure you guys go hit him up in the description below. And now let's get this over. Let's, you know, let's get this done with. Let's go. Let's go. I got confidence right now. I have confidence in myself right now. All right. So he's going to go instability with his Thunder's T. I am going to lead off with my Kyurem Black. So, let's see, let's see, let's see. Um, I recorded something in the team builder and I actually changed a move on Kyurem Black. I actually changed my uh, Outrage to Hidden Power Fire. Um, but let's see. If this thing is Scarfed, he could take us out. Um, definitely could take us out if he's Scarfed. Um, so, with that being said, let's see, we need Kyurem, uh, actually we need this set, Kyurem, let's see, we have 60, we have a minute still, we're good, we're good, we're good, we got a minute, alright, so let's go ahead and see, we need to pace here, we definitely need to get this big win though, we need to at least stay focused and we need to make plays safe because everyone's giving me shit about not playing Dench safely. <laughs> I thought it was a good battle, though, to be honest. All right, so we have Space Jam here, level 50. Um, I think the safe play would be goes for the Ice Beam. Uh, I feel like Ice Beam would definitely be our best play. He could switch into Scizor. Um, although we could Iron Head, except Iron Head's not doing much to this guy. Um, so you know what? I'm going to Ice Beam. I don't think he'll Choice Scarf this thing. Oh, yes! Oh! Focus Sash? 
Oh my gosh. Jolt. Jolt. Oh, we live. We fucking lived. Not bad. Not bad. Oh my gosh. Oh, what was the chance of that living? There's... N so he's not life orb, he's fo focus sashed. Oh my gosh. So we cannot let him get stealth rocks up. We cannot let get him to get stealth rocks up. I'm just going to ice beam again. He's probably going to switch. He's going he's gonna to switch. He's definitely going to switch. We need to get stealth rocks up ASAP. He's going to go into Gale Force, which is going to be the... It's going to be this guy. It's going to be this guy. If we got a freeze here, this would be amazing. And that still does a lot. Still does a lot. All right. Oh, Pursuit Trap. Oh, this thing's... Mm, I, why did I let Kirim go so early? Please don't have Pursuit. Hmm. He's going to have Pursuit. What do you have Pursuit, though? I don't think he would have Pursuit. All right. Uh, I need to make a play. I definitely need to make a play. Um... We're going to go into Milotic. Please don't have Pursuit. Please don't have Pursuit. Alright, he didn't have Pursuit. Uh, actually, does he have a Mond? Yeah, his only Mond to set up Stealth Rocks is Swamper. So he might not even have Rocks. He's going to withdraw Gale Force. That's fine. That's fine. Storm Surge. And I have no Hazard Removal. I have no Hazard Removal. Damn it. I gotta go back and cure him. I gotta dodge these stealth rocks. I have to dodge these stealth rocks. I have to dodge these stealth rocks because I know he's gonna. He knows he he needs to get rocks up. And he is going to be me all right. So he's gonna mega up. What can we really do to a mega swampert? All right. If he's defensive mega swampert, stealth rocks. Okay, we predicted that. So we need to get some extra damage off on this thing. Kirim's gonna die, unfortunately. Um, we just need to go for another ice beam. He might think we have hidden power grass, and he might switch out. Although we don't have any hazard removal, so unfortunately we're gonna have to go for an ice beam. We're gonna unfortunately have to go for an ice beam. Oh, this sucks! Ah, we lost Kirum. We lost Kirum. We lost Kirum. We lost Kirum. Oh, this sucks. This really sucks. Stealth rocks are doing some good damage to us. We need to get our own stealth rocks up, though. That's for sure. Because uh, he has Scizor with Defog, potentially. But then they, then again, that looked like a pretty offensive Scizor. Even though I am in, in defense. So, alright. Can we get a freeze? Let's see if we can get a freeze to help us out. He is defensive Scizor. He is defensive... Or, I'm sorry. He's defensive... Um, He's definitely defensive, uh, Swampert. Okay, so Kirim goes down. Kirim goes down. Kirim goes down. All right, we need to we need to calm down. We need to make a good play. Mega Venusaur could be our play. Mega Venusaur could be our play. So you know what? I'm going to go into actually Mega Venusaur now. I could have went into Glide Score. Definitely, possibly could have went into Glide Score as well. Um. Now the question is here is do we hit him power fire at this point? Do we hit him power fire? Or do we leech seed? Do we leech seed or hit him power fire? Um I'm going to leech seed because it, it adds a lot of pressure. Um it actually adds a lot of pressure to his team. It adds a lot of pressure to his team actually. So since Kirim's gone, oh my gosh, since Kirim's gone, we have no check. We have absolute no check to Sylveon. No check whatsoever unless Mega Venusaur's around. Oh my gosh, this is horrible. This is going, oh, this is horrible. Oh man. This is not good. I don't know. I was really debating on, on Volcanion this week, but I, I just, I don't know. I couldn't, I couldn't just, I couldn't.
couldn't bring myself to bring it just because of what Poi kind of brought last time. Like, Volcano didn't really do the most work against his team. So, he's going to withdraw. He's actually going to switch out. He's probably going to go into Scizor here. Cyclone, which is going to be the Salamence. That's fine, actually. That's actually fine. Um, so, now the real question is, is what is... All right, so we get the lead sheet off. That's good. Um, set, uh, we need to go into Venusaur here. We need to find out what Venusaur can do to this guy. Um, I think our best play would to potentially be to go into Tank, the Gramble. Um, just because we can get the Intimidate off. And then we can obviously play off everything. Um, so that's a thing. That's definitely a thing. Uh, because player off actually two shots everything on his team. Um, I'm gonna go into I'm gonna go into Gramble. I'm definitely gonna go into Gramble. All right. Uh, so let's see. We just can't miss a player off. If we miss a player off, that's gonna be rough. We're gonna take damage. We're gonna get, get intimidate off. And what's he gonna want to do? Is he is he special? Dragon Dance. Okay, well we got the Intimidate off, so that's fine. So that means he's gonna have to switch out, and we easily can get that uh, that Stealth Rocks back. All right, so there. That's a thing. That's that's a thing. Um. Now here's the thing: is does he predict that? Hmm. Um. I'm going to click a, the safe player off. He's probably going to go into Scissor. I'm going to kick myself if he goes into Scissor because we do have Fire Punch on him. I'm going to kick myself if he goes into Scissor. Uh, if he goes into Sylveon, I'm not going to be that upset because we're going to be doing half even if he's defensive uh, Sylveon. Uh, basically, his whole team we can do half on, to be honest. But now that we know he's Dragon Dance Kyurem, I need to write that down. I need to write that down. We need to definitely get some Stealth Rocks up. I'll tell you that for a fact. I don't even know if I have a pencil. I should have been prepared for this. I have a pencil right here. Alright, so Dragon Dance. What did he go for? What did he just go for? Well, whatever it was, he missed. Okay, never mind. Salamis is gone. Alright, so Salamis is gone. Okay. Alright, I guess. Um, Jetstream. This guy. Okay. Alright, now what do we do with him? This is the question. Alright, we definitely need to... Um, Superior at level 50, and we need Mega Venus or not, I'm sorry, not Mega Venus. So we need uh, Grand Bull. Uh, offensive, let's see. So we killed all right, so we killed Salamence with the, with the player off. Uh, if he's choice specs, now what if he's choice specs? Actually, if he's choice specs, I don't think it's killing us. Uh, let's see, choice specs. I need choice specs. I need choice specs. Um, if he's choice specs, it's going to be a roll for him to kill. And player off's doing 84 to him. But we can... If we're going to Mega Venusaur... If we're going to Mega Venusaur... At level 50... And what if he has hidden power flying? I gotta hurry. Alright, we gotta go into Mega Venusaur. We have to go into Mega Venusaur. So Salamence is out. So Salamence is out. That's a big check. We're gonna take Stealth Rock damage. 
Reflect. Okay, that's fine. I'm good with Reflect. I'm okay with Reflect. So I feel like his switch here would to be to go into his um, Scizor. So I'm going to Hidden Power Fire, actually. And if not, if he wants to stay in, that's fine because we can easily get off a Hidden Power Fire on this thing. He's going to Light Screen. Uh, Hidden Power Fire should be doing a, a good chunk to him. Even though we did reveal Hidden Power Fire now. And that's not doing much. That's not doing much. And he screens. I don't like that. I do not like that at all, actually. Glare. Hmm. Oh my god, come on. We needed that. Alright, so he has two turns of... Let's see, so this is the second turn... Let's see, because we went for a Hidden Power Fire on the light screen, which is one and then two. So he has three more turns left of that. Um, so since he's a defensive superior, um, the Reflect has three turns already. All right, so the Reflect has three turns already. All right, so that's Reflect. Reflect and light screen. I need to see how much. Uh, actually, no, because that's dumb. I think I just need to go for another sludge bomb. Oh, with this thing being crippled, it's going to be huge. He's going to go into Scizor. He's going to go into Scizor. Serenity, that's gonna be Oh the sludge bomb! Oh, but the light screen's up. Ooh. Alright, so here's gonna be the fourth turn. He's a defensive set. He's a defensive set on the Alright, so does that mean he's hyper voice? So if Reflect has four turns up, and this is the third turn of um of light screen. So what I need to do is I need to go set up my rocks, I think. <sighs> I, need, I need to go set up my rocks as much. Even a hyper voice. Hyper voice is going to do a lot, but we need to set up the rocks. Um, he's going to just calm mind. Mm, I don't like that. I don't like that. He knows he can set up on me right now. Oh, fuck. We cannot... Well, there's nothing we can do to this thing. Oh, there's nothing we can do to this thing. Oh, there's nothing we can do to this thing. I'm gonna taunt. Just because he knows he can call mine. At this point, I just... I don't even care about rocks right now. I just... I can't let this thing get call... I can't let this thing call mine anymore. I can't let this thing call mine anymore. Oh, that was big. Alright. I don't think a Moon Blast would be doing too much to us. He is going to Hyper Voice. I don't think this will kill. Doesn't kill, so that's fine. And the... Okay, so that was definitely a Light Clay. That's definitely a Light Clay... Um, that's definitely a Light Clay... What's it called? A uh, Light Clay Superior. So we definitely need to go for the stealth rocks. We need to get our stealth rocks up. We need to get the stealth rocks up. So there's there's Thunderous T right there. Alright. Unfortunately, Batty Coat is gone now. Unfortunately, Batty Coat is gone. Unfortunately, Batty Coat is gone. Hmm. So unfortunately, I have to bring him in. I have to bring in the big guns. Oh my gosh, this light clay, come on. If he has Psy Shock, we're in such a bad position. 
If he has Psy Shock, we're in such a bad position. If I let go, if I let go of Mega Venus Sword, we have we have Hidden Power Fire on Alakazam to take on Scizor. Uh, Gliscor is gone, and Kieran Black is gone. We have we have Gramble still, and he can pretty much wall Mega Swamper kind of. Milotic has Dragon Tail, so we can keep Dragon Tail with the rocks. I guess I got a Sludge Bomb here. Psy Shock, I fucking knew it. I fucking knew it. <clears throat> I fucking knew it. I fucking knew it. We need a poison. Oh my god, you thick mother... Thank you! Thank you! The reflect's gone. I'm just gonna leech seed here. I'm just gonna leech seed. Just gonna leech seed. This battle is definitely not going in our favor. Okay. I'm actually okay with that. I'm actually okay with that. Come on! Are you fucking kidding me? God. Gotta go in a tank. Jolt's just playing us, man. He just he's he prepped well for this. I he, he did. Gotta click player off. Gotta click player off. And it's just, it's funny because he, he can just basically, I don't know, he can just basically, Sylveon just sweeps my team, that's and the, that's the unfortunate part. Letting go Kieran was definitely too big. I definitely played that too hard. How did not expect Focus Sash, Thunder's T, makes no sense. Hyper voice that's gonna do a lot. There's game, I can't win this. I can't, I, there's no way I can win this. I can't win this. I can't win it at all. No way I can win this. No way I can win this.
I mean, this... Nah, Toxic didn't put it in range. I needed that to put it in range. I needed that to put it in range. So maybe if I went to Milotic? At this point, there's no saving it. He's gonna wish. He's gonna wish at this point. He prepped very well for this team. He knew I was going undefeated. Well, besides Jordy's technicality, but... Yeah, I guess I'm speechless. I'm just, I'm getting outplayed at this point. You know, there's like not it's not even like hidden. I'm just I'm I don't know. I have no idea. I mean, like and the thing is, I, I felt like I prepped really good. It's just like I had a gut feeling in my stomach. I was like, Sylveon is gonna be there to destroy lives, and I'm a hundred percent correct right now. I'm a hundred percent correct right now. There's like. He's probably calcing a lot of stuff. There's nothing I can do. Literally nothing I can do. And he's probably going to wish here. I guarantee he's probably going to wish. Sylveon just destroyed my life, and that's what it is. Oh, he's going to withdraw. Okay. Instability. Alright, so he's going to sack off this thing. Alright. Okay. Well, Sylveon's going to take a lot of Stealth Rock damage here, so... I mean, it's not a 6-0, which... I'm not over... Com I'm not complaining about at all. Um... <clears throat> it's funny, because we, we killed the two threats that we, like, really prepared for, which is going to be Jetstream now. Um, that's fine, because... Uh, I can actually just Dragon Tail here. Um... Which I have no problem doing. I have no problem... In, I have no problem... I have no problem in dragon tailing. <laughs> Get out of here. 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 This guy. Get out of here. I'm scald. I'm scalding. He's gonna go into he's gonna go into Sylveon, which is obvious. Which is very obvious. Unless he wants to sack this thing off, which I don't really know of why, or where, or when. Uh, I mean, like, there's, it's not, it's not technically done. I mean, if I can just keep, like, if I can get Sylveon out of there, I can just Dragon Tail all day. Which, obviously, Sylveon's gonna come right here. Serenity, there we go. There's that thing. Uh, actually, uh, we, I don't know. If we can put this thing in poison range, come on. Nope. Uh, actually, we outspeed Sylveon. We outspeed Sylveon for a fact. I'm going to scald. Because I will play the dragon, I will play the dragon tail game all day. Oh, there we go. Okay, um... Oh, did Milotic just help us out? Glassword got... Well, did Gla no, Glassword didn't get to get the kill. Glassword got one kill. Superior. Alright, um... We need a Dragon Tail. We need a Dragon Tail. Alright. And this is the fifth turn of... I gotta recover. Or do I scald? 
Or do I scald? Oh god. Do I scald or do I recover? Okay, what are my options? If I scald, I get some damage off. I get a potential burn. That's not going to help. Um, if I Ice Beam, do I do anything really damage-wise? Um... I'm going to Ice Beam. Oh, Bug Bite's going to kill. Oh, he probably has Bullet Punch. He probably has Bullet Punch. Oh, I know for a fact he has Bullet Punch. Uh, it's fine. I guess we can go for Hidden Power Fire. Gotta go for Hidden Power Fire. And there's bullet punch, and there's the match. Oh my gosh. I thought we had the comeback. Oh my gosh, Joel, that was a great game. Unfortunately, we take our first official. Well, I mean, the, the loss against Jordy was official, but this is like our actual, like, taste of a loss. Like, I don't know, like a loss feeling. So, again, make sure you guys go hit up Joel in the, uh, in the description. That was a good game, man. I mean, it was definitely like the differential was like not all the way, all the way there, but... Uh, my logic started bringing it back for us a little bit. So, again, if you guys enjoyed today's battle, then make sure you guys hit that thumbs up down below. It's going to be greatly appreciated. Make sure, again, go hit up my boy Jolt. He's at, like, 1,300, almost 1,400 subscribers. Uploads awesome content. I'm actually part of the, uh, his league, which is the NPL. And uh, we're not doing so hot over there. Jolt's beating me 3-0 twice. And, oh, my gosh. I don't... His, his squad is just it's so hard to prepare for you know it just it puts so many checks in my team but again that's gonna be the battle again if you guys height or uh, you know i don't know i'm just i'm at like a loss of words like i was confident going into this game but like i guess i wasn't confident in like the squad to actually get it done if that makes like i mean i know they could get it done it's just like the way we played i think was like a little too potentially a little too risky slash safe i don't know i gotta find like what's really like on you know with my mind about it but again if you guys enjoyed today's battle make sure you guys hit that thumbs up down below make sure you guys hit up jolt again all his links are in the description below as well as my twitch twitter and instagram and uh with that being said we're gonna have to take this uh sour l to the face and we're gonna have to move on to next week so next week uh week seven we do play blake in the baltimore braviaries that's gonna have to be a big win because that's gonna either uh, put us down or pick us up. So with that being said guys um, I don't think I have anything else more to say make sure you guys drop your MVP in the comment section below both sides and uh, With that being said, I'm gonna get up out of here So make sure you have yourselves a great morning night even day wherever you're at and I'll talk to you guys later Thank you for watching. What is cracking goes? See you The salt It's running through my veins